Hey there, Wade Betts here with the Betts team over at Guardian Mortgage. Thank you so much for visiting our video blog today. Today's topic is non-occupant co-borrowers. What does that mean and who can benefit? So a lot of times I'm approached by first-time home buyers as they're trying to break into home ownership for the first time. And it can be a struggle uh, for them, frankly, whether it's the debt to income ratios or having enough assets for down payment and closing costs. Uh, it can be an uphill battle for some first-time home buyers. Sometimes they're fortunate enough to have family members that are willing to help with their first purchase. Now, a lot of times the parents, because that's the, the typical scenario, the parents offer to buy the property for the adult children. Uh, and if that's the case, that gets treated as actually as an investment property. And those terms are radically different than if it was treated as a non-occupant co-borrower. So what I mean by that is the adult child is the occupant, the parents are the non-occupant co-borrower. So the parents' income and assets can be used to help qualify uh, or uh, supplement uh, the adult child's um, uh, income and assets. And it's a way to help people get into homes and get a leg up uh, in life. So we do many of these uh, per year. If you're considering or uh, planning on doing this in the future, please reach out to us for a conversation. We'd be honored to help and lay out a game plan so that everyone can accomplish their goals, okay? So thank you so much for visiting our video blog. Have a great rest of your day, and we'll be in touch. Bye-bye.